My boyfriend told me that he needed to risco and I don't want him to get it from outside. Mm. As a mother, because mm. she's like a mother figure to me. So I came to her, I begged her, because I don't want my boyfriend to leave me. I really loved him so much. Uh, good day, ladies and gentlemen. It's your boy, Ipali Ebony. And with me here is a lovely lady. She came to me this morning and she told me something very interesting, which I would like us to see how can I iron it out. Hey, young lady, please, can you replay what you told me this morning? Like I told you earlier, I've been having issues with my boyfriend. Yes. And my somebody I look up to, my I look up to her like an auntie, like a mom. I'm having serious issue and now she has gradually stolen my boyfriend from me and I don't know what to do. I don't understand your 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 senior friend like like somebody you are looking up to like an auntie yes. has got you took taken over your telling your boyfriend from you. I, I I don't understand how is that supposed to mean? I okay my boyfriend needs something so I went to her for help. Through the help, my boyfriend has just fallen falling for her. I don't know what to do. Like right now I'm just going so into emotional trauma. I don't know what to do right now. I need help, please. Now, can I ask you something? For how long have you been dating this guy? I've been dating him for over five years now. Five years? Yes. And I don't understand all the five years that you've been dating this guy does that your 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 senior friend or your auntie so to say does that has she known that guy for that long also yes she know him i told i told her about him she know him then uh, when did you people started having this uh, problem for instance since last year since last year you mean that since last year your auntie has been like taking over your boyfriend and you've been fight, fighting these battles for almost a year now yes yes sir like precise like what time last year like around what time like since last year september up to now okay september till now eh? yes. so i don't really so what are you doing have you really called your boyfriend to see how he's going to react have you talked to him i've talked to him i've begged him but he has fallen for her i don't know what to do right now and uh, like, how old is your boyfriend? And that's your auntie. Like, what's their age difference? My boyfriend is 25, and my auntie is 34, 35. Jesus, I don't understand what I'm, what you are telling me. Your boyfriend is like 25, and your auntie is like 34, 35. Yes. And your boyfriend left you fine girl like you for your auntie. No, just answer the question. Yes, yes. Ha. This whole thing is very funny, but nevertheless, that your auntie, do you have a number so that I can call her as we normally do then hear from her? Yes, I have a number. So you can equally give me a number so that I can call her? Yes, yes. All right, no problem. Thank you very much. We'll see how we can call her now, hear from her. But before we call her, you, you still have your boyfriend's number now? Yes, I have his number. And uh, uh, your boyfriend, how do, do are, you, are you sure that if we call him, he's going to come also? Yes, he'll come. He'll come. All right, so your auntie, um, even if we get to her, now we can also get to her also, Abby. Yes, yes. All right, then there is no problem with that. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, as you can hear, we want to try to reach the auntie so that we can know exactly what happened between both of them. Thank you very much. Uh, good day, ladies and gentlemen. Like I said this morning, uh, we've called the friend and the friend is coming right now. Let's just give her some seconds. She'll soon be here. Okay, now she did come, sir. Yes, yes, she's the one. All right. Uh, Madam, good morning. Good morning, sir. How are you doing now? Please, can you just come a little bit closer? Uh, I don't know if you know this uh, young lady beside me here. Yeah. I know her. She's my friend. She's I'm like a mother to her. You are like a mother to her? Yes. This is very interesting. Huh? Uh, this morning, she came to me to complain, to, to lay a complaint that um, her boyfriend is getting how do i say this now getting close to you like her boyfriend is now hanging out with you so i just said i should call you so i can see how we can resolve this matter amicably is there anything like that and the problem is that i was on my own and she came to me that she will help her that her boyfriend need two to one what do you mean by two to one three score three score yes young lady Okay, let me first ask you. So, exactly what happened then? So, she came and missed me that I should help her, that she will pay me 50000 <laughs> And she has already paid me the money. 
Really? Yes, and I helped her boyfriend and I left. So for now, I don't have any business with the boyfriend. As you can see, my phone is ringing. He's the one that is calling me. He cannot even allow my phone to rest again. Uh uh. I don't understand. Uh, young lady, you told me initially that there was no problem between the both of you. Now she's telling me a different story that it was you. Now you tell me now you that it was you that asked her to help you out. How did you how did you ask her to help you? My boyfriend told me that he needed to school and I don't want him to get it from outside. Mm. As a mother, because mm. she's like a mother figure to me. So I came to her, I begged her because I don't want my boyfriend to leave me. I really loved him so much. So I came to her for help. Just for help, instead of her to help me, mm. she stole my boyfriend from me. Jesus Christ. So, from what she's saying now, she asked you to help her. Eh? Just to help her to do the three score with her boyfriend. Yes. Sir. Now, I then how come you now took the boyfriend from her? That's my concern now. I did not take the boyfriend away from her. The oh. problem is that the boyfriend did not allow me to rest. 247 is disturbing my phone. So when he called me, I will go. It's still the help now, but I don't, for me, I don't even want it. From the beginning, I said I cannot do it. She was begging me seriously that she help her. And I help her. And now it's leading to another thing. Uh -uh. Young lady, so I don't understand. How do we now resolve this problem now? Because initially you told me that there was nothing that your, your, your auntie, your senior friend, just on her own took over your boyfriend but now the story i'm hearing is a different one that you invited the, your friend to come and help you is you know what you're saying yes but just for once just for once but why is she still going now my boyfriend is just all over her in fact she's the one pursuing my boyfriend she should please leave my boyfriend for me please huh. i'm begging her please leave my boyfriend for me i still love him madam from what she's saying now she said you should please leave up you know that you are like a mother you are a senior sister, a senior friend. She said you should leave a boyfriend for her. So what? why are you still, you understand me, so attending to him when he calls you? It's not me that is running after a boyfriend. It's the boyfriend that is running after me. So to solve this issue, yeah. the boyfriend should stop chasing after me. Uh, young lady, you hear what she said? Your boyfriend has right to who he wants to date. You understand what I'm saying? But for now, you understand me, so you have to walk out a way that two of you will have peace you find a way to talk to your boyfriend so that there will be peace no she's the one chasing him not my boyfriend chasing her she's the one chasing me if he tell you to come you can also tell him that i don't want to come or i don't have chance you can give him excuse but she's still going uh -uh. madam let me ask you one question please let me ask you this thing is getting interesting are you telling me that whenever the boyfriend come, calls you you still attend to him is that what you're telling me who oh, no like better thing? <laughs> I will go. I, I also need money like her. Uh-uh. So if the boy but initially she paid you 50k from what you are saying, that you should no long you should not do it again with him. But every time the boyfriend still calls, you still attend to him. At least you find a way to see that because she is your like the boyfriend is like your daughter's boyfriend. You understand what I'm saying now? So I think on your own, you should have your a good use your good conscience to say, No, I have done what I needed to help my friend with. But for now, after he's a young, she's a young girl, you are far older than her. You understand me? So as you have done what you have to do for her, she should be able to you should be able to say, Okay, let them continue. Is it not what you are supposed to advise the boy? I have talked to this boy several times mm -hmm. and I was also advising, mm -hmm. but he refused. So there's nothing I can do about it. So the boyfriend himself have to choose who he loves and have to stop Jesus. following me. Mm. It is the boyfriend that can stop this problem. It is not even me. It is the boyfriend that will stop it. <laughs> so you mean that even now, if the boyfriend calls you, you still attend to him? That's what you are telling me now. Like yesterday, he has not called me. Who knows whether if he call me or not today? I don't know if he will call me. But if he calls me and insists, maybe I can go. Maybe it's maybe you are saying you no know, in the presence of your your daughter and you are but smiling over it. For eh? me, mm -hmm. I don't want to. Okay, you don't want I don't want I want it to stop. So all I want from the boyfriend is the boyfriend should stop too. So if the boyfriend stop, there's no problem. There'll be peace. Uh uh. So how are we going to solve this matter now? What do you think we should do now? Because maybe there is something, madam, 
I be get what you did do we make the boyfriend not degree. They still they come your system. I don't understand. We need to work out something at least to make sure that because from what she's saying, like how old is your boyfriend, please? My boyfriend is twenty five. Twenty five. Yes. Then you, you how many years? Me, I'm twenty two. Really. I don't have to ask you because I don't want to cause any problem. Because me looking at you, I know that you are far older than her. So if the boyfriend is 25, so from what you are saying that she's older than your boyfriend, she Yes, she's older than my boyfriend. She's uh, 35. Jesus. Uh, <laughs> Madam, is there, any, what, is there anything we can do now to make sure say that boy? Is there anything we can do so that you leave the boy for her? The fact is that the boyfriend should come. Let us settle it here and let it end here. The boyfriend should come? Yes. So that we settle it here yes. and let it end here? Yes. Okay. Uh, people, you people have heard from both of them. Maybe we have to just call the boyfriend so that we'll be able to hear from him also as the third party to be able to know who, which of them is willing to be with her and we are going to settle this matter amicably. Thank you very much. Let's call the boyfriend. Thank you very much.